I think research was a tool. You know, and I looked at the research as, uh, as much as anybody else, but, and it's a very big but, you also have got to go by your own, by your own convictions and your own passions about things. Uh, you know, a show like uh, Hill Street didn't test well. You know, they just, it was too dark. They'd never, you know, the, the program analyzer had never seen anything like that show before. In that case, in the pilot, you know, a couple of the leads got killed off, so that uh, didn't help. And uh, the prognosis wasn't good, but there was such enthusiasm for the show within NBC, you know, that I ended up saying, testing be damned, we're going to put it on the air. And there are other shows uh, that I could think of, you know, where there's a similar story, all in the family, went through the floor. I mean, they, they hated it. The recommendations were change Archie Bunker's character which is absurd, because that's what made the show work. So, you know, program testing can't tell you what the next hit is going to be if it's brand new, because they have no, there are no norms to compare it to. And uh, I think what you do is you take a look at the testing, and you very carefully evaluate what the testing says. And you say, can it be fixed? Is it terminal? Uh, can a piece of a casting make the difference? Can a change in emphasis make the difference? And, uh, and again, it becomes one of several different factors that, uh, that ends up uh, determining what goes on the air. Because I've also seen shows that tested very well that went on the air and bombed. You know, my favorite story about testing, we did uh, Charlie's Angels and tested the 90-minute pilot, which got one of the lowest scores in the history of ASI. And, and the show went on the air and got a 55 share on a Sunday night. And then we ordered a series up and we had about five rough cuts. That's with shows without music and effects. And we tested the five rough cuts and one was lower than the other. You know, it was so bad that in order to come up with some kind of a release schedule for these shows for the fall, we actually d drew straws out of a hat in order to schedule this thing. And it went on the air and became the number one show. And this is one with one of the lowest tests in the history of ASI. So, you know, you if you follow the testing too closely, it uh, it can really lead you down the wrong path.